Telephone wire, landline wire. Set it up to uh, a couple of these lights for a miniature video shoot. And just to have them handy, they're going to be 9 volt powered LED with switches. So all you got to do is grab your light and go. No cord needed. I looked at several of these miniature lights on Thingiverse. This was one of the better designs. And like I said, I will attribute that at a later date. But what I liked about them, we're not going to worry too much about cleaning them up because these are going to be utilitarian. But the designer put a wire channel in here. I'm not sure how good it prints it out. But we'll see. It seems to be feeding. And there it is. And then Oh Let's see We will make this the front Because I want my nice side up I got some boogers on the back side of that print So We'll go into it just like that Not this switch right here in the back. And the best way I found to do this, I don't see my big torch, is kind of nasty. You cannot drill this 3D print plastic. It will shatter, break apart, especially a piece this thin. See a little color there in the metal. How to do it? Actually, it's putting a little dimple in there too, which I kind of like. Okay, so on the inside, I am going to have to get in there and cut that. There we go. She's getting red hot now. Oh, yeah. That's better. Got it. That's a little better. Now it sticks out. And it stays in so we can hot glue that together. Got some wires stripped. Got everything set up here. So we'll do a little flux out.
more dollar store stuff. Perfect for this sort of thing. Living in the country. Got to stock up on these. I usually buy at least half a dozen packs before I leave town to come home. Okay, well, there's that. Let's check our switch, see if we did it right. Nice. I, can, I made a special rubber mold to make a lens on the front here. It came with, uh, there's those funky little, it came with little covers to print. So I made a rubber mold to cast some clear acrylic lenses for it. And then these printed out wrong for some reason. I'm gonna have to scale them up because they don't fit. Not even close. cast just took the 3d printed part laid some shipping tape down on there to get a little better smooth surface they didn't come out perfect but still pretty clear mm -hmm. 